I've decided that if I want to be a successful Hearts of Iron 4 YouTuber, I need to complete the coveted Platinum Trophy. So today we are tackling Don't Die For Your Country. So the 1939 Germany start, we need to occupy all of Poland and France without taking more than 475 casualties. So I have tried this numerous times and I could get absolutely nowhere near it. Problem I'm having is with the most recent updates is you need to take Corsica for this. So you either have to naval invade it or take out the UK to force the peace deal. Both of which are impossible without taking losses because you always end up in a battle. So I've read a naughty strategy here. So basically if I just win the war, take the land in the peace deal, I'll be occupying it and then the casualties will reset because of the peace deal. And then the trophy should just pop. So that's what I'm going to try and we'll see if it's true. So we've just got to knock the allies out and we should win apparently. So we have the war goal on Poland already. 122 divisions, so we've got a lot of infantry. What are we looking at? I haven't done 9039 before. Not bad, 18 width. 18 width again, but no support. Okay, we'll work with them. We'll research. It's going to be short, I'm hoping. So let's go a couple of infantry equipment. Uh, b -b -b what else do we want? Let's go artillery, 81 days. Engineer as well. Let's just build some mills. Not sure how many of these we're actually going to churn out, but let's get building. We have got a load of subs, so that is good. We'll get them convoy raiding the Atlantic. And we've got a big Greeks marina, so we will keep that in reserve because we're going to need that for naval invasion. Let's get old Eric Raider and Carl Dunst. And then, ooh, 66 factories. Infantry equipment, support equipment, artillery. Let's go and get Goebbels as well for the war support. And change you for the offensive. We'll get Commerce Raider, ground support. Yeah, division recovery we'll have. Uh, infantry expert, and we haven't got enough command power, so we'll get one later. So I... Why is Danzig or War not done? That's bizarre. I do... I just made that up. No, I do have the War on Poland. Bizarre. I haven't got Danzig or War yet. That's really bizarre. Okay. Let's get an agency built. I don't know why 1939 this isn't started. They need to update that. Army all set up. So we've got one army on the French border on the Maginot line to hold. And the rest will just be crushing into Poland. We've changed all the divisions. So I've just got the same infantry the Panzer Divisions and some Mountaineers. Get our Luftwaffe up and over Western Poland. Not a bad size to start with. And let's go declare war. World War II has started. So let's no go Danziger War bypass. Very nice. And we will start on around the Maginot. We'll just cut in as well. I don't want any allies to come in and support Poland. So we'll try and split them in half immediately. And beeline for Warsaw. Hopefully they don't put too much of a fight up. That's all cut off. Let's push in. We'll take Danzig as well so they can't get any troops or supply in. Our equipment's looking okay. Just missing a bit of infantry equipment. Full of Warsaw. Tidy up these pockets. Oh no, don't need to. There goes Poland. Task 1 complete. Poland is gone. So let's get Rommel out. He is going to be invading the Netherlands who are up next. Right, partition of Poland. So I think I need all of Poland. So I wouldn't have done the pact. But I think I'm going to have to say no because I think I'll lose it all. Let's just hope that doesn't bite me and I can finish this before they attack. Let's get this done quickly. So let's also set up our invasion of Britain as well. Let's go around the Maginot. As soon as Rommel's in, we will declare on the Netherlands. Let's get going. They're going to stand zero chance. Just waiting on the naval invasion to finish or set up. Netherlands got... Oh, bollocks. It has bit me in the arse. I'm going to have to take out the Soviets. Damn it. Ah, oh, I really didn't want that to happen. 
okay, right, luckily I've got all these divisions, so just go sit here while we finish off the Allies. Luckily, the Soviets shouldn't be too powerful. Next up for Rommel, though, is Belgium, and then on to France. Belgium, battle planning, because I'm lazy. All the air over, nice cast damage, lovely jubbly. Belgium is gone, so let's get some panzers, where are you there? And let's beeline all the way to Paris. And knock the French out, yeah, round them, easy peasy. Lemon, squeezy, let's cut them off and do a little Dunkirk as well. Yeah, that's France gone as soon as we hit midnight. There we go, goodbye France. So I need to not set up Vichy because I need to own the land. So let's not do Vichy. And there we go, big boy Germany. Now just Britain. So just waiting to get naval supremacy. Eastern front's fine. The Soviets are not attacking. So that's all good. Ah, I must have had a battle that I missed. And they've damaged my navy. Damn. I really didn't want that. Didn't want that at all. Screw it. Yeah, there it is. Oh, we took eight. So they must be repairing as well. Let's force my Kriegsmarine around and hopefully I'll just grab... Oh, yellow again, damn. I thought I'd get naval supremacy. There we go. We are off. We are off. On to the Geordies. Sorry, Geordies. We are coming. Let's quickly push out. No one at home to stop us, which is nice. Yeah, split them in two. Let's just beeline for the coast. Making our way down south. Yeah, Rommel's also joined to push as well. They've got a few divisions. Bombing our way through. Taking Berman and Leicester. London's gone. Yeah, they have got no one at home. Into Portsmouth. Cardiff should be it. That should be them capped. Oh, no. What? What are they at? 99, bloody hell. One more tile or so. True. There we go. Allies done. And we shall just start by grabbing all of the land. I didn't have to get anyone else in, so it is all ours. Uh, I'm just going to puppet like Australia, Canada, New Zealand, South Africa. We'll have a German Raj as well. Let's go and grab all the navies. Not that I'll need them, but... All fun and games, we might as well. Right, there we go. Big boy German, Reich, allies defeated. Now I've just got to defeat the Soviets, which will be fun. Let's go and improve the national spirit as well. We'll get rid of the bitter loser, because that is definitely not us anymore. Oh, Christ, what has happened to my front line in Soviets? Why is that messed up? No harm done, though. We've got the nice five armies to join so let's go and grab them look at our big chonky crinks marina now 500 unfortunately there's not really anyone who's going to battle us in the sea to have fun with but we'll at least sink the soviets in the baltic and then i might actually set up a naval invasion into leningrad naval invasion went off okay i didn't manage to get leningrad but we are just waiting for a port to be built 7th of april there we go, port is built, let's get two full armies in and then we've got another front line towards a Moscow. We are into May in the spring, so we are full guns ahead now, battle planning, we are rolling the Soviets over. Hopefully we can just join this up, we've got a few trapped here so we'll move into, I can't what these islands are called, but they are going to be ours. What the Soviets got, about 230, 40 units? got quite a lot actually don't know what their supply and uh, equipment's like we've got a nice encirclement though and we've joined up our two front lines we will keep pushing we haven't taken leningrad so let's push up here kiev's gone nice green air getting all our cast and fighters over it don't stand a chance the soviet air into ukraine area we'll push down to sevastopol Ooh, Moscow. Oh, I wasn't even paying attention to that. Oh, yeah, beeline some troops there. There we go. Let's go down to Stalingrad as well. We'll push this way. We'll just keep pushing. They've barely got any troops. We'll just encircle and destroy. Stalingrad is gone as well. No big fight this time, Soviets. Pushing down. We will surround the mountains. 
Nice encirclement there. We'll close these two off. We'll just get some plans going. There we go. Split off. So the Caucasus are now surrounded. So we will push down towards Baku. And battle plan that way. We will then get another one. Let's go over the Urals. Yeah, there we go. Get that going. 94%. Not much left. Finland's obviously in the war as well. Bessarabia's been handed over for no reason whatsoever. Oh, we might be done. Is that it done or are we frozen? Done or frozen? Done. We are done. No help from anyone else. We will just take all the land and we might as well have the navy for Bantz. Yeah, exit that peace deal and hopefully that should mean... Are we going to get the achievement pot? If this is correct, and now technically I hold both areas and have... Yes, it did! I'm absolutely amazed that actually worked. There we go. Don't die for your country. So, it did work. Use that strat, guys. That's as easy as you like. Just roll over the Allies, roll over the Soviets. I think if you hand over Poland, it might not pop, maybe, because technically you won't occupy it. I'm not too sure, but there we go. October 40. Nice big chonky navy now. Achievement popped. There we go. All good. Use this as a bit of a guide if you like. It's nice and easy. Definitely works this method. Stay tuned for more and peace out.